is his hero pool, his agent pool, sorry. And uh, whether or not he really has the raise that he can pull out. They've gone for a bit of aggression towards Arcade. He'll be flanking in the retake, but it's Celsius that hits the floor first. Jazz going one for one there, not able to rendezvous away. In version one, they have the sight, but I don't think they'll be expecting. How did Where's Sick get Sick another one? There's a gap. Yeah. A gap in is. the wall, the aftershock. It denies the plan for just for a moment. He buys enough time as well. Look, Tens has worked his way into drop. The situation could arise, but still the kills are going the way of version one. Can they try and find the timing? Tens a quick little jiggle. Takes out the swing there, but being shut down in the end. Now Zoms, it's a 1v2 for him. Can he do anything with this one? This would be amazing. The volley could be amazing. Just about forces the 1v1. I think Tens is just kind of not that great at split because his jet hasn't looked amazing there either. I'm interested to see what development he's made on this age. I mean, that is a good start. Uh, does you he even need the, me. Does he need the utility this if you can shoot like that? It's not about the agent, man. It's about a skill. The guy's got it in spades. He's just reminding everybody. Apparently. Now, they're not going to be able to reclaim those guns. B1 taking up that position. And they've contact walked all the way through halls. The wall dropped down. That's going to be stopping that one. Do they know that Tens is still here? Slight angle. He finds it. The cross placement was excellent. The nade. It's a little bit too deep for him, but still, he will not be denied. Four kills on it now. Just needs to find that last player, and he might just be locking up the ace. What? Oh. Am I watching? Oh, oh, one kind of predictable in terms of how they path through Ascent. But Sentinels do not look like they've got the read on this round. Flash onto the corner. Most to drop down, and... They're only running the solo controller, so they know that this hit is probably going to be coming through onto B. It's not going to be a fake play. It's not to rotate pretty hard and fast here for Sentinels. All of them really gathering up around Generator. And you see that utility that gets sent in. That was an aftershock and a nade. Did we claiming any kills? No. The players planted just next to that staircase. They're all down to V1 to try and play these post plants now with the rifles in hand. They've got, they've got Penny in a really good position. And Whippy and Zelsis also covering across. Here comes the ult. Showstopper. Oh my word. A quick little flip around the corner. He finds it. And Sentinels, of course, in the capitalize. They push through the smokes. One He's still holding on to that aftershock, though. The few sound triggered it for him. But he does not anti kill But it becomes much more dangerous when you know that Penny is holding his tour de force in hand. It's a jiggle from Shaz. Risky. Very risky. And he does get punished. Gives him a weapon. Intelligent. Tense. I mean, I'm, I'm calling it intelligence. That's mad damage. I'm thinking, okay, this guy, he's uh, got the x-ray vision on. <laughs> it's just, in reality, it's very intelligent play from him to be able to know that that timing was being taken. A quick dash, though, into the site with those satchels. Elsis has cut the angles up. The aftershock as well. Nobody can really play close. The wall dropped down. Rolling Thunder. It's chaos and pandemonium. Just spread across this entire point. And now... <gasps> Oh my Effie's goodness. with a bit of a whiff. That's I a think huge he, whiff. Did he run out of bullets there? But Sick is the last player alive. Stunned up, 1v2. 70 health to his name, has the stun. The fault line gets sent through, but Whippy just Look swings in. his positioned here as well. He's been getting his trademarks broken towards Dish. So he's thinking, all right, maybe version one are going to try and break my trademark again. So this time I'm going to double up. Yeah. Me and the trademark are going to hold Dish. Good little nade comes through. The satchel just not enough. And now you see that Brimalt, the orbital strike to try and clear out the site. V1, we're going to get it for free quite for free obviously in exchange of all those ultimates Shaz is very worried about a, a timing being taken against him here but it's actually Dapper that's on the flank the other way around got caught by Penny's trademark goes down. they know Dapper's here it's so important for Dapper to get kills and he gets shut down this horse control that V1 they so reactive in their approach to try and at least lock that down so it makes it way more difficult for the retake to happen for Sentinel still water force in hand anything could happen with Shaz we were not giving them an inch, not showing anything. The flash is perfect. Just couldn't turn it in time. And the swing on top of it, V1, so well drilled. And the stimmy is not it's enough. actually working. Pop. Yeah, it's working really nicely. These small feints from version 1 in the early round, they're actually opening the door for B hits. Yep. Showstopper gets used right into the back of it, but it's actually Sentinel the ones who come out with the kills. Dapper gets the pick on the whippy nose with the molly that's laid down, and Sick is doing magic. The numbers he's putting up right now, Xander left alone, it's a 1v3 for him, and he knows no opportunity to get that spike down. And not at all. Version 1 had their opening, they'd crafted this opportunity where it was only Zoms that was the threat. Oh, well, this but time... the sight anchor is just so good. He's got the spike though, Xander, has yeah. the spike. And there's not going to be any time for Xander to reposition. 
does he even begin to think about when he's gonna stun in the usual location? You gotta be kidding me! Don't let him get away without one. In the wonder. post plant, they're gonna hope that Penny can find a timing to kill Zapper or Tens later on. Oh, whoa, okay. okay. Xander got caught by that breach holder. Yep, all's being used here. Zapper just spraying. I don't think he had too much information to really glean from that one, but it instantly forces out that res. He won. I just need to try and get this plant down, but still the kill's just returning. Sentinel's doing oh, doing the damage, doing the work as they're trying to push around this one, but luckily the coverage is once more there. Force held down, Spike's still not there. 4v1 in terms of the plant going down. The regroup, stun. Some space to try and burst down that wall. Shaz just on top shot. of it, a slight pixel for him. You can just kills. get that sight line over the top of it. Both Zoms and Sick finding picks in that manner. But it was a thrifty for version 1. Yep. Flash through now with weapons in hand. Quick little jiggle from Xander. He knows there's a player there. Shaz! They timing it. He TPs right into the aftershock as they were pushing in. But Zappa, what a timing. Could catch something here. Only gets the one eventually before being traded. V1, they've gained control of the site. That was such a cool play by both teams. Not only the aftershock to punish Shazam. But then Shaz was bait for Dapper. Ends up being a 4v3, though, in the post plan for version 1. Drops on the pistol to try and open up the door. The Whippy sees it. He knows yeah. it's a fake. He knows it's a fake. He's a patient for it now. Tends with the ult. He knows they're all going to be grouped up around there. So much damage. How did it not find a pick? This nade from Zelsis just to push him away for a moment. Now the smoke, it fades. Sick has worked his way in, but he does not have any sort of flashes to work with. The rolling thunder and Zelsis, well, wow, he's taking point for the rest of his team. The ultimate sets it up. How many more did they see? All five players of version one are stacked outside halls. But I think they only know the breach, raise, chamber. Oh here. my god, the swing timing. What a play. It's perfect. That's so good. When the boombox comes out, the defensive orb is always going to want to find that peak. And the flash comes through immediately afterwards. Tens just getting dominated by the raise ultimate play, being out of play as well. And Penny, well, Sun has come alive. Top of the scoreboard for his team, as far as I'm concerned, I think. They've just got such a perfect read on what Sentinels want to do with their utility yeah. on defense there. That is a masterclass round by V1. But a reminder that they are still behind. The best case scenario for them in this half is a 6 6. They're setting themselves up for it quite nicely. This is a share. Well, Tens is in. Good. Yeah. And now Sentinel's doing actually a very similar play to what he did prior when he had a bit more guns in hand. This smoke. Taking the opportunity to push through it, but V1, I mean, they're instantly running up on this one. Dapper, he has to get some value here. Anchoring away, but, I mean, the, the angles are already being watched. V1 were more than ready for this one. Up in hand, Penny. He's happy. He'll just keep holding this one. A little jiggle peek to try and see if they can bait the shot and the swing. Now with the molly laid down, there's no chance in hell. And then they even can expect that from Penny to just be pushing it. Good return from Zoms, but Sander had his teammates back. It's a quick swing, a quick answer. If there's any silver line, it's that they don't expect Sick to be here. He has his ultimate, oh, but it's so not going to be holding a slight angle. I mean, not even a slight angle. He's literally holding the one and done using. Lying on his uh, rendezvous to try they and get him out it. of it. It's pinged. Pushed away in the end, though. There you go. And now we see the hit comes through. Grim Smoke's laid down. Buff in process as well. It's going to be the site given to Sentinels. It's important, though, now that they hold down a lot of these extremities surrounding the site. A halls. It looks like the players are prioritizing it. I love that Tens has kept his position over by Dish as well. He'll be in such a great spot for this retake. Version 1 love going fast as soon as they commit. The utility. Aftershock comes through the flashes. Unable to play the game. Dapper does still get one. Trade it out. Ten smoked off. He can't do anything. The nade pushes him just off and away. Now it's the fuse coming through. They're spying through with the pistols. Surely not. Whippy can't stick this. The wall. He's deny it eventually. It finally does. The wall. It gets broken. But now it's half online. Zom's so weak. The smoke as well. Xander. He's going to try and stick this. 56 after his name. I don't believe it. He finds the round for them. They just can't punish it in time. I think it's possibly Shaz who set him up with that one. That would make sense. Yeah, I'm not too sure. He's got full cool armor as well. Yeah, he's a true raid boss right now. And it, all the reliance on him. Bursting up here into Nest. Players aren't even just yet. Satchel, run a gun from Xander. Wants to try and punish it. Put it, a stop to it before they really get deep onto this site still. Viper Wall splitting it up. Do they know Whippy is holding right around the corner? He tries to catch the timing. Swings around a bit of run and gun. Has been ordered.
He gets two, eventually taken out, but now the two for two. Tens has to get what a trade. The stuff done here. Three kills and Effie's with an A crunch. Giving Dapper the orb over by Dish. Maybe Tens, honestly. Maybe Dapper gets the plant. But either way, getting those ults online with the alt orbs that they'll take. Always uses the response. Okay. Ball line was sent out. They've actually gone past. The alt orb without prioritizing it here. I really thought Tens would go for that one. So unusual for them. Still, Shaz gets that pick. Put a TP to safety on top of it. Tens was catching a timing all the way around. It's so disjointed. They're a bit out of sync from it, but still, Zoms is the one who comes up with the goods. The players they got into the site from that drop location. He wants just probably too aware of it. Still, Penny wants to try and make it dangerous. He's zooming in with the stimmy. Spectre. Whoa, yeah, what is that shot? Him, V1. Penny is low. Dapper could get the spray down. Wipers pit. It's dropped down. It's going to make them think that they have to clear it. <gasps> Santa killed him. It's a disaster. Unbelievable. He'd thrown that molly out so long ago that Penny thought it was completely no safe. But You're Xander, me. He's now in the 1v1. Doesn't quite know Shaz's position. 19 bullets. Spectre in hand. He needs to clear this one. The 1v1. Shaz needs to win this one. And he pushes. The yeah. optimal disrespected the broom smoke that was used early for Penny is watching this angle. Now we see another smoke being used right in the way. Penny has to back around this corner. Version one have cleared out both sides of A. They're pretty confident it's going to be a B hit. Whippy comes over. He's playing by Canteen. Yeah. They if might just be walked into a trap. If Xander gets a single kill from Arcade, he has his brim ult. and that would be devastating for Sentinels. It's done. Utility is being sent back as well, and now you might just start to see a little bit of chaos sent through. Cross Here comes the Brimolt. The purpose. There's the Brimolt. Xander still holding it, but a quick flick of the wrist. Soms finds another one. Tens pops his ult. With Whippy falling, he can at least slow this down just a tad. B1 might be looking to maybe try and retake this one. And oh, it's a beautiful aftershock. It denies the plant, it forces Zoms to swing out, and it sets up Penny for the pick once more, holding the angle, Shaz wins it out! Two kills for him, what are you doing? Working with, Penny does have the rifle in hand, but they walled it off. They walled it off. So they sage walled it off. They're breaking the line aside of it to try and catch the timing. This could work beautifully. I d not, Zoms looks aware. unaware. Not aware. Okay, just about watching it still. Worst guns in hand, and they're still finding the value. It's those thrifty rounds. They're coming for Sentinels at the worst possible opportunities. Way. The Breach Halt as well. Sick is one away, but he's going to have to hit a nasty flick if he wants to be able to get this one online. Is it? That's the duck and weave around the corner. The weaponry is not quite there. He is being pressured from so many angles right now, and the swing is there. Santa! Could have been a player just holding around the corner on top of it. It's going to be used. He knows he has to push forward. The pressure is on the stun. He counteracts. It's still tens. He's straight into the site. Double satchels in play. They have control of it, but they've lost Dish and they've lost the horse control. Rolling Thunder to push all the way through. Trying to regain a bit of this one, but V1 again. Not stepping off the gas. They're straight across the point. Once more, the site in their hands. What a Brim Molly. Yeah, the Molly to stop it off, but they do have that Brim ult. Push them away, and Thomas is going to be gaining that kill. Still half on the plant. He gives his life to get that half down. 2v3. Quick little swing around the corner. Sentinels, they've got to come up huge. It's already half. They have to swing around the corner. He's just sticking it. And they're caught once more. Like unaware. Rimalt won the round for Sentinels previously. This one looks like a B split straight off the rip here. Tens has his ultimate. Flash catches Penny. Tens. Just to just hold here, Penny. Could catch a monstrous timing against them. Zombies, he's looking at the iPads. Ah, it's been covered. Little jiggle peek. Has to back away. That first piece of danger dealt with, but now there's Xander in heaven that they have to contend with as well. Oh, and this angle that we've seen fail so many defenders works out for Xander. He takes down the star player of Sentinels. And he stays alive. Sentinels left wondering, how do we salvage this one? Tens is down. It's a bit of run and gun from Zombs. Spectre in hand, but Whippy. Oh, he shut it down. 29 health enough to work with though and now only two players left alive for sentinels this could be it this could be the finale dapper left alone and it cannot be done